Welcome back, my friends, to the Mile High Poker Den. Today we got us a half-baked Snorlax. Look at him, he's cheesing right now. And then a clearance tin. As you guys should know by now, we love the clearance tins. Uh, I mostly picked this one up because of this sun and moon back here. That you can't see, because we all know I don't do so well with the sword and shield. But that's all right. Let's get into the Snorlax. Save the clearance for the end. Exciting. I'm not gonna lie, I love this Snorlax pin. He just looks so baked. Oh yeah, like he just had a good blunt and a good meal and he is content. And with the bent card, well that's all right, cause like I've said before, I buy enough cards that this will flatten out. There he is. Maybe that is after the good meal. Now he's just like, mm, time for a nap. Sir, sword and shield with the sun and moon. Trying to get that Lunala. I can do cool voices too. So today, guys, we got a sword and shield, sun and moon, clearance tin. Not going to hesitate. Get into this. Get these out of the way. I'm going to laugh because usually when I talk shit, I get good pulls. So I'm just going to keep talking shit about sword and shield. Yeah, I'm going to get nothing in here. There's nothing. But here's something for you guys. Special order. <laughs> I'll do three. Get rid of the lightning. Quick. It's a quick ball. We got Mantine. A Dottler. Maractus. I actually really like that artwork. Oh, and there's my, my mud braid that just got out of the mushroom field. You can't catch him. He's too high. We got a poniard, a score bunny. I have this in a holographic, and it actually looks pretty cool. We got a nicket, nick, nick, nicket, a reverse hollow schnom, which if I was snowshoe, you could probably find this in Colorado. And on the end, oh, nice, this is new. Okay, sword and shield. You, I must not be talking enough shit, but I'll take this, a toxic croak hollow. And I love the vertical holographic. Way to go, Toxic Croak. Leading the way. Dope. Let's get this other sword and shield out of the way so I can go and head and pull open my Lunala card. Lunala GX. Yeah. Go back there, baby. Another code card for y'all. And Paul's trick, because we want to see the energy first. It's the psychic energy to go with my Lunala. That's a good sign. And here's the perverted, perverted, <laughs> perverted dub trio. Showing off his little bits because these guys are like, put that away. Pokemon Center Lady. Energy Retrieval. There's the Jolt Tick. And we have the five stars to land it. Somebody slapped her back. We have a Palababus. And there's a Ghastly in the haunted hotel. A Rookie D. And then these terrible reverse hollow metal saucer, followed by oh, 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 with the red rock V. Oh, nice, giving a haymaker. I like its eyeballs. The eyeball hollow on it is awesome. I don't know if you guys can even tell. There, kind of boom. Sweet. So we got a V card out of there. That's a really good pull for me. <laughs> the sorted <and> shield. <laughs> And I might wait on that one. I might need a tool for this. Oh. Boom. Now children, make sure there's an adult around when you use these. Just kidding, hopefully no children are watching this. Especially my videos. 
like, you're all innocent, then you go to Vietnam, and then you come back, and you're like, hey, ma, pass me the fucking potatoes. Woo! All right, Paul opened up one of these, and he got some pretty good pulls out of it. If it was this one, it was two rainbows, but no, it was the Zoroark one. No, it was the Tapu Bulu. Oh, the other pudding. I have the yellow pudding, Tapu Coco. Which this is a bit off centered. Mm, yeah. mm. Well, that's all right. We will take it. Get rid of that. Let's see what I got in here. It's like three, four packs. We got a guard, two Guardian Rises. Oh, yes, and an evolution. And the Super Saiyan Deer Dog. <laughs> Let's get into these Guardian Rising. What can I get in here? I don't know. I'm sure I've opened up this before, but I still don't really know what I can get. Let's see here. Uh, okay, that was a good guess. A good guess, Tones. And then I'm going to do just three, just in case. Is it four? Aha! That's because I got my, my partner next to me helping me out. My PIC. Part, I already did the code trick. Partner, partner in collecting. <laughs> awesome. We got the altar of soon ready for sacrifices. And a uh, Malo chilling outside getting those high vibing energies. Oh, now we got an altar of the moon also ready for a sacrifice. Clefairy. <laughs> Really? An ice cream cone? Come on, guys. Wishy-washy. This is pretty cool artwork. When you get a whole bunch of them together, they make a piranha-looking thing. We got a Gumi. I've actually never heard of that one. We got the Wimpy Bug. And here is the, <laughs> the Mario-looking pervert mustache Probopass. On the end, we have... Ooh, nice! A Mimikyu. Do not lift up its skirt because it will attack and violence. I like that. I like Mimikyu because it's like a darker version of Pikachu. Like if you opened up your closet, that would be there. <laughs> not a bad run. I do like that Mimikyu. Another Guardian Rising. What kind of GXs can I get out of there? Can I get that as a GX? What is that? No, that's not Garatina. That's that Jenga Mo O or something. Yeah, that's the, yeah. Oh, giving it away with a green card. There you go. It's a code card for you. And we'll do four. Starting with that grass. Burning that grass. Nice. We have the Angry Hedgehog, the Watchhog. A Glally. Why can't I ever say this one? Glally, Glally, it's a snowball. We have the enhanced hammer of Chansey. There's a Gothica and a Lolan Vulpix, which I like Vulpix either way, whether it's regular or a Lolan. It's just so damn cute. We have a Fletchly. Well, that's cool, Machop. I haven't seen this one before. A Reverse Hollow Energy Recycler. I like this Reverse Hollow. And on the end. Followed by a triple ice cream cone. Oh man, just what I wanted. Not, oh, I, oh, look, I almost skipped this one. Yo, Steam Siege. Let's see if I can change the rule with Steam Siege. Paul said it sucks. I'm gonna say it's awesome and I'm gonna get the best pulls right now. W whatever those are, which I don't know what those are. <laughs> Boom, code card, just for you. Don't ask me for anything for Christmas. Just three. We'll go with three. Better better be safe. Oh, and we have the two-headed Zoelius with a bunch of wounds on it. Because it's blind. A claw flossel. Flossel. Fossil is what I meant. A skip loom. And there's a rough lit. And this, this is a really silly looking Litleo. <laughs> a Meryl. Ponyta, locked in a cage. That's not cool. Oh, oh, and then a dino. See, those are wounds on it. Those aren't just cool red features. And this is another stupid Pokemon. 
Okay, all right, all right. I see why Steam Shoes kind of sucks, because, I mean, some clogs. Is this part of the keychain gang? And on the end, oh, it's a holographic Hydreigon. Nice, I did, look. Look at this, can I get the other one real fast? It's in here, there it is. There's, like, this. Boom! I just evolved my Pokemon. I do like this, this is pretty sweet. This is a pretty sweet Pokemon. It looks like it can see now as well. I can't wait to read the little box and see what it has to say about it. And this is actually a first for me. I don't have a Hydreigon. Dope. I'll take it. All right, Steam Siege, you earned some points there. Now I can defend you a little bit. Like, like I can defend rap right now. Not much, but a little bit. <laughs> you know what? I'll sleeve those up later. Let's get into... PSC says Sun and Moon. Yeah. Come on, Lunala. Ooh, she's, ooh you're going to be rough with me? Don't tease me, baby. Don't tease me. There we go. <laughs> it's playing hard to get. Uh, there is a co-card for y'all. And then... Oh, the card's a little bent at the top. Hmm... And then energy, yes, the darkness energy. And it starts off with a howl. We got a really sad looking wishy-washy. Why does Pokemon make some of their Pokemon look so sad? And then we have the fat rat. We have a picky peck, Carvana, Togodomaru, a Chinchow, followed by a Makuhita, Makuhita. Let me get one of those. Put extra alcohol in it. A reverse hollow Torah cat. And on the end, an incineroar. Non holographic, but at least he's not doing his weird flame pelvic thrust. All right, you let me down, Sun and Moon. Evolutions. Going for the Blastoise. Can I get the Blastoise? This is the Mega Blastoise. I'll take any kind of Blastoise. Or even a Venusaur. Uh, Co-card is backwards. Here you go. This one just burns three because the energy is somewhere else in this in this hand. A potion. We have us a Magmar. Ooh, a Venusaur. Am I gonna get it? The regular Venusaur. The Spear Link. Growlithe. We got us a Machop. A Nidoran. A Ponyta now free out of the cage. We have a dra, a, a dra, dra uh, excuse me, drowsy. Oh, sick! Got us a reverse hollow fairy energy card. Heck yeah! Oh, uh oh, evolve some Charmeleon. Uh oh. Oh, holographic Charizard! Nice, look at that. Hands are clammy now. Gotta put it down. Oh my goodness. Oh, oh god. My heart is beating so fast. Oh, it all added up to this. Sick. I have this in reverse, but I really wanted the holographic after I saw Paul pull his. Oh my goodness. Now that was an epic finish. There was the cum shot. All right. Oh, or the money, yeah, money's shot. That's what I meant. Yeah. <laughs> dope, dope. This was a good run. See, those clearance tins just love us. I swear it. Got the reverse hollow fairy energy. Love it. Paul and I love the reverse energies. We got the holographic Charizard. We have a reverse hollow energy recycler. How did you end up in there? A Hydreigon. My boy Mimikyu, or girl, or whatever it is. Hey, it has no resistance or weakness. Sick. Yeah, weakness. And the Reggie Rock V with the cool eyes. The Tapu Coco promo, followed by a Toxic Crow. Probably one of the better pulls I've gotten out of Sorted Shield. <laughs> oh, yeah. And then the Fat Snorlax. Feeling good. That's me right now. That's how happy I am. <laughs> All right, guys, that was the video. If you liked it, please leave a like and a comment. Tell me what your favorite Pokemon was. 
which I could probably guess. Uh, <laughs> um, what was I saying? Like and subscribe. Did I already say that? I might have already said that. Anyways, guys, I hope y'all are doing well. Hope you're getting outside, getting some sun, some of that vitamin D. We will catch you again on the next episode.